Joyce DeWitt, a seasoned actress recognized for her role as Janet Wood in the classic television sitcom Three's Company, has left an indelible mark on the entertainment industry. While her portrayal of the sensible and lovable Janet endeared her to audiences worldwide, one might wonder if there are lesser known facts or anecdotes that add layers to her intriguing persona. Alternatively, reflecting on the first moment one recognized Joyce DeWitt on screen brings a sense of nostalgia, considering the impact she has had on the cultural landscape. As we delve into the legacy of Joyce DeWitt, it's an opportunity to share cherished memories or personal experiences related to this Hollywood stalwart. Did a particular performance resonate with you, or perhaps there's an off-screen story that adds a human touch to her on-screen presence? We invite you to share your stories and memories in the comments below, celebrating the career of Joyce DeWitt and the moments that have made her a timeless figure in the world of entertainment. Share your insights and connect with fellow enthusiasts, reminiscing about the contributions of Joyce DeWitt to the golden era of television. Your narratives add depth to the collective appreciation for this iconic actress. Joyce DeWitt, known for her role in the popular TV sitcom Three's Company, holds a master's degree in acting from the University of California, Los Angeles. This educational background laid the foundation for her successful career in the entertainment industry. Residing in California and New Mexico since August 2003, DeWitt has maintained a dual residence, balancing her professional commitments and personal life. Despite her fame, she values privacy and has chosen a relatively low-key lifestyle. In 2020, DeWitt faced a setback when the Hunterdon Hills Playhouse in Hampton, New Jersey, where she was scheduled to debut a new comedy, closed due to the pandemic. The venue's closure left the production in limbo, adding an unexpected challenge to her career. These experiences highlight Joyce DeWitt's academic achievements, lifestyle choices, and the impact of unforeseen events on her professional endeavors. As she continues to navigate the ever-changing landscape of the entertainment industry, DeWitt remains a respected figure, celebrated for her talent and versatility. Residing primarily in Santa Fe, New Mexico, actress Joyce DeWitt maintains a dual residence, dividing her time between California and the Southwest. Known for her diverse ancestry, which includes Irish, Italian, and Swedish roots, DeWitt brings a rich cultural background to her career in the entertainment industry. Following the conclusion of the Three's Company series in 1984, DeWitt made a notable return to the stage in 1987 at the Burt Reynolds Theater in Jupiter, Florida. This marked a pivotal moment in her post-sitcom career, showcasing her commitment to live performances. In addition to her on-screen work, DeWitt actively engages with fans at conventions and continues to demonstrate her acting prowess on stages across the country. Despite facing challenges, such as the closure of the Hunterdon Hills Playhouse in 2020, she remains resilient in her pursuit of a successful and versatile career. From her cultural heritage to her on-stage comeback, Joyce DeWitt's life and career reflect a dynamic journey in the entertainment world. As she navigates the industry's twists and turns, DeWitt's story continues to captivate audiences, showcasing her enduring talent and commitment. After the conclusion of Three's Company in 1984, Joyce DeWitt embarked on a global journey, exploring different cultures before finding her home in New Mexico. Despite the passage of time, a 30-year rift with co-star Susan Summers ended in 2012 when they reunited on Susan's web series. Notably, DeWitt's commitment to her principles shone during the show's production. She insisted on wearing pantyhose or tights, causing a stir with producers, but earning her a role as the spokesperson for Legs Pantyhose. In a bold move in 1979, she stood her ground against the network, missing an episode until her promised raise was reinstated. This resilience and adherence to her values characterized DeWitt's dynamic career and life. Reuniting on Susan Summers' online talk show Breaking Through, Joyce DeWitt and her former Three's Company co-star ended a 30-year rift. The reunion marked their first conversation since Summers' 1981 termination from the sitcom due to a salary dispute. 
Notably, DeWitt's commitment to principles was evident during the show's production, where she insisted on wearing pantyhose or tights, earning her a role as the spokesperson for Legs Pantyhose. In 1979, she stood firm against the network, missing an episode until her promised raise was reinstated. This resilience and adherence to values characterized DeWitt's dynamic career and life, showcasing her enduring talent and commitment. Former high school cheerleader Joyce DeWitt's journey into the entertainment world took a surprising turn when, in the late 1970s, she auditioned for the role of Fonzie's girlfriend on Happy Days. Despite being deemed too short and young for the part, fate had other plans for DeWitt. Just weeks later, she secured the role of Janet Wood on the iconic sitcom Three's Company, launching her into television stardom. This unexpected twist in her career marked the beginning of a successful and enduring presence in the entertainment industry. From cheering on the sidelines to gracing the television screen, DeWitt's transition highlights the unpredictable nature of showbiz. Her determination to forge a path in the industry, even after a setback, exemplifies the resilience that would become a hallmark of her dynamic career. This early chapter in DeWitt's journey sets the stage for a remarkable career filled with highs, lows, and the unwavering commitment to her craft. Whether on the cheerleading squad or in front of the camera, Joyce DeWitt's story is one of seizing opportunities, overcoming challenges, and leaving an indelible mark on the world of entertainment. The audition that didn't land her a role on Happy Days ultimately led her to a place where she would become a household name, forever etched in the annals of television history. Joyce DeWitt's journey in the entertainment industry took unexpected turns, shaping her dynamic career. Beyond her on-screen success, notable events added layers to her story. In 2010, she pled no contest to a misdemeanor Dewey, a moment that revealed a different facet of her life. However, it's worth noting that her contributions to the industry extend beyond controversies. One interesting aspect is her language proficiency. DeWitt learned Spanish in school, showcasing her dedication to broadening her skills. This linguistic ability likely contributed to her versatile performances in the entertainment world. Moreover, her involvement in the iconic sitcom Three's Company included favorite and least favorite episodes. Alongside co-star John Ritter, the duo cherished the episode up in the air featuring Ritter's Emmy-nominated comic dance. On the flip side, DeWitt's least favorite, Janet Wiggs Out, marked a challenging episode that led to a departure of a regular character. These anecdotes provide a glimpse into Joyce DeWitt's multifaceted career, where personal and professional aspects intertwine. From legal challenges to language skills and on-set dynamics, her story is one of resilience and growth in the face of various experiences. As we bid adieu to this journey through the remarkable career of actress Joyce DeWitt, let the curtain fall not on her performances, but rather on the tapestry of memories she has woven into the fabric of our lives. Each role she embodied, a stroke on the canvas of our collective consciousness, resonates with a unique harmony that reverberates through time. Now, it's your turn to step into the spotlight of reflection. What memories of Joyce DeWitt's performances linger in the corridors of your mind? Was it her comedic finesse in Three's Company or perhaps the poignant moments she brought to life in other projects? In this digital theater of memories, your thoughts take center stage. Consider this an invitation to share your personal connection with actress Joyce DeWitt. Let your words dance across the stage of our community, a testament to the enduring impact she has had on countless hearts. Unearth those cherished moments, the scenes that made you laugh, cry, or simply pause to ponder the beauty of her craft. As the applause of remembrance echoes, let us collectively celebrate the artistry that is Joyce DeWitt. Your stories, a symphony of shared experiences, enrich the narrative of her legacy. In this space, your voice becomes a part of the grand performance, transcending time and space. In closing, we extend our deepest appreciation for joining us on this journey through the cinematic tapestry of actress Joyce DeWitt. Your time and interest in commemorating her contributions to entertainment are the standing ovation she truly deserves. Thank you, and until our narratives intertwine once more.